Hey guys, Nil here, back with another video and today uh, is a Tuesday, means it's our tech shot video and in this episode particularly we are going to compare Kirin 970 with the Snapdragon 660 and why I am going to compare both this uh, processor because one is a flagship grade and second one is a mid range but there are uh, there is only 3000 rupees difference between these smartphones so let's get compared both the CPUs so when we are talking about the CPUs firstly we will talk about how many cores are there so both the CPUs has the 8 cores and the 8 threads so there is a no differentiation in the number of C uh, CPU cores but when it's come to the performance clock speed matters the most so uh, in the 970 we have the 4 cores clocked at 2.4 gigahertz and another 4 at 1.8 gigahertz uh, when 660 4 cores at 2.2 gigahertz and 4 cores at 1.84 gigahertz the semiconductor size because this thing also matters when it's come to the performance so 970 based on 10 millimeter where 660 based on the 14 millimeter so there is a big difference between these two processor when it's come to the RAM management firstly we need to talk about how many channels of memory are there so both the has the two channels of memory but when it come to the RAM performance we need to see how many megahertz speeds RAM support in the CPU so 970 supports 1600 megahertz where uh, 660 supports 1886 megahertz download speed so in the 970 we are getting 1200 MB per second speed support where in the 660 we are getting uh, 600 Mbps support let's talk about the upload speed so both has the 150 Mbps speed okay so let's talk about the last and the most important thing which differentiate both this thing so when it's come to the performance reading and writing things are also matter so we are talking about maximum memory bandwidth so it is the amount of time taken by the processor to read the stored data so in the 970 we are getting 12 point around uh, 12.36 gigahertz and in the 660 we are getting 7.43 so as you can see there are the uh, vast difference around 5 gigahertz uh, difference for the memory bandwidth that's why there is a lots of performance difference between the uh, flagship rate processor and budget grade processor and in this place semiconductor size also matter because of that 970 get a speed boost into the maximum memory bandwidth so uh, that's why the honor play is much more better than the xiaomi's mi a2 when it's come to the hardware but when it's come to the software xiaomi mi a2 wins the uh, battle because of the android one so let's talk about what is the final score of the hardware compared so Kirin 970 got the 3 points where the, uh, where the Snapdragon 660 get the 1 point and that's why the Kirin 970 is better and uh, better than the 660 and for the last point I want to tell you in the 970 you are also getting the dedicated neural engine that's why it has the greater performance and greater camera resolution and greater camera modes and other things so that's it from me guys what do you think about this video let me know in the comment section thanks for watching peace